Guinea pigs can look very cute from above, but when you examine them up close, you can see serious issues. On the 12th of February, three guinea pigs were surrendered to Cavi Central. Sadly, these had been in the owner's care for up to four and a half years. Bumblefoot of this nature doesn't occur overnight, and there has been enormous suffering involved. They believed this was genetic, as other guinea pigs didn't have it. This is not the case, and all three have very specific reasons as to why it has occurred. This shows a complete lack of knowledge and ignorance that has led to a large amount of suffering. Due to the pain associated with walking, a great deal of standing has meant that they've also had urine scald and fungal from standing in one damp location. This little guinea pig in particular almost wasn't surrendered due to the owner's attachment and feeling that she was more settled, calm and friendly. However, again, lack of knowledge is very clear as the reason she is so easy to pick up is that she is completely blind. At some point she has sustained a rear leg injury which is part of the reason Bumblefoot has occurred on the front paws due to a change in weight bearing and being very apprehensive and uncertain about moving forward. To rescue is far more than finding homes for guinea pigs. It provides a safe haven as well as a place of treatment, care and extensive knowledge around best practice to ensure that they can live comfortably and well and overcome such illnesses and problems. Piggies like these take up permanent residence where their care is assured or may lay to be red flag piggies to find special care homes. As a rescuer I make really hard decisions and constantly have to deal with this. Rescuers do not pass them on and they don't walk away. I'm always grateful for the support of my followers and I thank you, thank you, thank you and hope to constantly bring you value as a voice for the voiceless.